Hello ladies Sins and Karma Houdinis, we're going to play another Spelunky custom level pack. This time it's King Yama's Gauntlet by Completely Karma. Travel for an epic arena and kill all the enemies, what could be more fun than that? I can think of a few things sexually related. Have you got the skills to beat? King Yama's Gauntlet! Well, we are going to find out and the answer is yes. Yes, it's absolutely yes, so many messages. Oh yeah, let me see the messages. Welcome to King Yama's Gauntlet version 1.0. One made that completely karma. You have inserted yourself into the game. These are the rules. Kill most of the monsters. I will kill all the monsters. That's really the only rule. Have fun, okay? <laughs> Thanks. Thanks for all those uh, all those lengthy rules. Hopefully I can remember uh, what the rules are about. Oh, I see. This is like a... Like a... Um, a way to help you on your way along. I don't need those items. I'm just going to empty-handedly destroy all these guys. Actually, I don't have... A means to kill these guys on the, the bombs. Actually, if I do kill this guy, how about this? We're going to try and do something like this. Ah, there's uh, one of those guys. Ah, there's some bombs over there. Okay. Mm. Oh, that's good. There you go. Whew. <laughs> I, I was, I'm good. I'm still okay. We're totally going to make this happen. Uh, with just bombs, that's what's going to happen here. That dude is pretty damn easy to dispatch. And I wanted it. Whoa! <laughs> yeah, this is not going to work, is it? <laughs> still alive? Still alive? No, alive anymore. But this is totally doable. I can kill these guys without using bomb. I mean, without using the shotgun and the jetpack. All it takes is a little bit of fun. In fact, I think I can throw a bomb right there. Almost landed where I wanted it, and now I can kind of screw it, aren't I? I can do something like that. There you go. Got super lucky there, by the way. And uh, some spikes you throw into my face. Very useful. In fact, I can just do something like that. I'll dispatch a few more of these guys. Not really. Okay, now I can just uh, spike shoot my way into killing one of these spiders, which is very, very important, I feel, to get that paste. And now I'm able to... Ooh! To kill the other Yeti without having to worry too much about things. I would very much like to kill one of these Vlads. Because that allows me to be able to jump. Oh yeah, things are happening here. Without the help of any of those those cheapo items. I don't need your help, friend. I know that you were you were just trying to help me out, but I have just my own skills and of course all these free crates. Uh they are they are playing a bit of a role here. I think I can do stuff like that. I really shouldn't have used up so many bombs actually. That was kind of silly. Kind of silly. All right, that man is insane. Now that should kill two of those yetis. Okay. No problem solved. Oh boy, I have seven health. There, have that, Vlad. That should destroy both of those guys. I should use one of these... Oh, man, they're all dead. They're all dead. So we have uh, been victorious, first level. Yeah, good stuff. Everybody's dead. They don't even need the jetpack or the shotgun. I am just too badass for those items. Psh, whatever, man. Let's just go for the next one. Ooh, a uh, shield. I'll take the shield. Because it's, it's a very non-standard item. I was hoping to destroy that. I was very, uh... Surprised just now. Uh oh. <laughs> this, is, this is a bad spot to put myself into. Just remember, I have Vlad's cape right here. And that is something that I earned through a feat. A feat of uh, violent endurance. What? No, 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 no. Ow, that sucks. I no longer have that cape. I don't know if I can make it. I, I had a sticky bombs. Not anymore. Oh, what what you got? Shields can block psychic blasts, but not targets. Uh, all right, that's good to know. I wasn't really aware of that. Psh. But thank you for telling me though, because it's very not. Uh, actually, I did not have it in my head at all. So I am very happy that you have reminded me of that. I hopefully will be helped by the fact. I think that landed close enough. Ah, uh, they not. Okay, that works. 
Alrighty. Now there's psychic blasts involved. And eight bombs in my inventory. That's good. Do something like this. I can kill the alien lords through this. Oh, come on. I would, I would eventually kill the alien lord with this. But I think that will take forever. So let's not do that. Ah! Jeez! <laughs> I'm an idiot. I think that will destroy. Yeah, that's very good. Because I want... I want to kill this guy without having to... Oh, I can use the shield. I might be able to do something with the shield. Okay, this is a bad position to put myself into, though. Yeah, this is not going to work. <laughs> what I can do is maybe do something like that. Uh, not close enough, I don't think. Yep, not close enough, and now I kind of messed up completely. Hmm, how to kill this guy without resorting to the shotgun? Hmm. Uh, very disappointing about it is those spikes did not get destroyed. Right. <laughs> oh man, this is so cool. Uh, what we're probably going to have to do is put a bomb there, and then that. Well, what I might be able to do is actually push the bomb with the shield. It's kind of crazy, but it might be the thing I need to do. Uh oh. Uh oh, yeah, I, I, I was not going to work. I really want to do it without using the shotgun and the jetpack, but um, I don't know. I might not be able to do something like that in this one. Really tough to pull it off. There you go, some extra bombs for me. Wonder why the bombs are not sliding. Normally they slide a, a decent amount of uh, room. Not today though. Not in this particular predicament. Alrighty, I should be able to... Something like that. Ah, oh, that... There. That, that's totally going to bounce way too far. Oh, it didn't. Okay, I don't know how, how, why that happened. I think... Oh, yeah, okay, the... Ah! Jeez! What exploded it? I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. Anyway, let's just uh, give up. I think I need to give up because um, uh, I don't want to spend, uh, you know, the next three hours because I don't know how far this goes, but if it goes all the way to Yama, I'm not going to go crazy. I, I will go crazy by... Uh... Oh, man. thing is that Shanghai makes this so easy, though. It's like uh, there's no uh, middle ground. Between between shotgun and whip, <laughs> well, it would be cool to have the boomerang here. That would be an okay thing to have. It will still take uh, quite a lot of effort to kill these guys without the kind of sort of cheesy the cheesiness of uh, shotgun and jackpack. I should maybe not grab the jackpack. That might be the like the middle ground type of thing. One way or another, things are going to be much easier now. Because I ain't got no time for no nonsense. Okay, all these purple pieces of garbage chasing me around. And this, you know, it's an arena. It's an arena gauntlet. There's no weird mechanics going on, it's just kill. And that is a refreshing, refreshing change of pace as far as I am concerned. I'm not going to go for that, that would be silly. Uh, no, no, no. Don't get me wrong, I love those weird ass puzzles and all that stuff. But uh, it's nice to get a custom level where I all I need to do is kill things. I'm a great fan of such things. Death and destruction. I almost left these guys alive. Is there something like down there? Nice, you see, I just... Uh, the edge of my Let's go up there and then we're going to keep the shield. Because that's the non-standard item that we have going here. There you go. Probably we'll regret it. I guess I could have also thrown 
stuff, like from the shield of, of dudes. Does this block anything? I very much doubt it. <laughs> Let's not even, not even go there. Let's go through the exit, because I'm pretty sure this is a, a 16 level pack, or even a 20 level pack. So, yeah, it's 1-3, even though it looks, it looks hellish. It is still 1-3. Um, no jetpack, huh? Okay, out to lunch. Alrighty. Eh, let's use the shield. I know the camera will uh, dispose of all of my enemies, but I can still crush these people. The jetpack is just not an issue, I guess. One way or another. Come on, I want to crush you guys. There, there's one guy crushed. <laughs> Kabloom! Okay, well, these guys are being really uncooperative and, you know, sticking their horns up my butt and I do not appreciate it. Oh, come on, guys! This shield has such weird interaction. Now, of course, I'm going to get myself killed here. Is that a surprise to anybody? That I wonder if I needed that anchor. Oh, it's just a bit of a shortcut here. Mm -mm -mm, but I guess something I can do is that. That is entertaining, but the thing is I just destroy my own <laughs> my own shield. That sucks. Anyway, this is pretty cool. Okay, everybody now is dead. Let's get rid of all these corpses. Uh, an everyday problem if I ever saw any. And uh oh yeah, they are completely moon immune by the way, something that you might not be aware of. They these guys, the green helmet guys. They're immune to the camera. It's really weird. Uh, which creates a bit of a problem here. But what you can do is just that. You can use corpses to get them out of their shell and now they are no longer... They're no longer the shy wallflowers. Oh yeah, that's right. I have a flat skate now. They're no longer the shy wallflowers that they were in the past. They're out and about and socializing. Very nice and... This is... You go for the... Vlad's cape here. I'm a-okay with that. Let's not get murdered. <laughs> because very likely that will be murder here. Oh, look, look, it's a Galeazar. With nobody to sacrifice, really. Ah, oh, there is some... Sacrifices. What? You, oh, <laughs> there's still a ghost here. No, no, I just jumped into spikes. Well, that was pathetic. Uh, there's a ghost here, so that makes the whole experience that much harder. Pretty tough. Let's go and help ourselves to the camera. Huh? Because that makes killing all the undead people that much easier. Super duper easy. There you go, another succubi. Succubus. Why is the freaking pearl? You must use the proper nomenclature. Oh, come on. Well, that is the thing that just happened. At least we get a cape. Eh. Let's just slowly kill these fools through the power of my corpse throwing. Yet again, another instance where. I have real life experience to get through these levels. There you go. Oh, come on. I want this caveman. Ah, I did not even realize I was at one health. <laughs> Whoops. That's okay, though. I don't think it doesn't seem like we need that uh, on Conan to just get a little bit more extra health. But the objective here is to kill everybody, so of course we're going to do that. And what better way than to have this man jump straight into the spikes at the bottom. Alrighty, so I'm a bit concerned about this. Uh-oh. Yeah, because it's designed to throw you into spikes like that. What I should be doing... Huh. Don't throw the blocks at the bottom, apparently, because they crush the exit. They block the exit. So, yeah, this is getting a little harder. I am... Um... Of two minds about that, that is perfectly fine to have a hard level and with a lot of uh, pretty damn difficult situations here. And I can only imagine it will get a little bit harder as time progresses. Let's kill that thing. 
as the levels progress. Oh man, we have more of those gross demons. Let's keep uh, one of these guys. Oh, okay, that was unnecessary. Cavemen painting my anus. Alright, so we'll just stump. Oh, come on! <laughs> ah, well, 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 well. Revenge! Revenge stumping right here. There you go. And now we get the Vlad's cape. I really don't want to throw down the block. That is bad. Where's the camera, though? What the hell happened to it? Is it just hidden down here? Where the hell did I leave my camera? I have no idea what happened to it. It's probably, you know, buried under a sea of corpses. Just like the rest of my murder victims. And I'm probably going to die here again. Because my camera vanished. <laughs> it's just buried under all those corpses, I'm sure. So let's not uh, misplace it anymore. Pretty damn stupid. With that guy. I just keep losing a lot of health where I really shouldn't. Look at that. Oh, yeah, that parachute is to descend uh, safely onto the spikes, possibly. Let's kill the vampire. Start killing everybody in a much more efficient manner, please. Be much more careful. There you go. Stump that. Okay, that's not going to work. I need to. I think if I whip that down there, no, it will not damage anybody. Okay, that's a bit of a problem down there, isn't it? Mm -mm -mm. Ah, if I throw it, throw it with enough concussive force, it will totally damage these assholes. Oh boy, it would be great to destroy one of those blocks. Wow, I should not have done that. <laughs> It's okay though because no, I just jump down there and whip it in the back. It's all good. Give me my camera, please. I am so happy to have this camera. There you go. You don't mean to drop that down there, but that's alright. So I need to drop this one. The other one is a bad idea. Of course, we have to kill everybody. Those are the rules. It must happen. Yeah. Oh wow, okay. Way to miss that toss. Corpse tossing, and you will think I'll be better at it. Oh my goodness, you're still alive. I just want you to drop dead. There. Okay. So I think the cape is the way to go here. And of course the camera. <laughs> there you go. Uh-oh. There you go. Ha! Fools! You have been pictured. Might as well do this. Too bad it doesn't let me... Um, Push the other one, the other side. I should really just stand here and it'll just drop into spikes. Yeah, there you go. Let's activate this moron too. Oh, I can just do this. Uh, uh, I want to go in there. <laughs> and I have to go in there. That's the rules. I have to destroy them. Huh. I guess I could do something like that. We get a Vlad. And a regular vampire. Okay, this is bad. How do I kill that guy? How do I get out of here? <laughs> this, is, this is a bad situation to be in. Oh man, I was hoping to... That's too bad. Uh, how do I kill these guys before the two minute mark? That is the giant problem in this level that I just now realized. I don't have enough time to stun everybody because you have to kill everything so slowly. Maybe the way to do it is to push the blocks. Maybe the way to do it is to push the blocks all the way. And uh, get the corpses. No, what, what? I just drop into spikes like a moron. Well, <laughs> I think I need to do it a lot faster. I do the whole thing a lot faster. And holy shit, is this goes all the way to hell like this? Holy crap, this is going to be a lengthy process. Uh, the thing is, you know, the moment you die and you lose your shotgun, this becomes that much harder. So I need to be much faster. I need to maybe push my way through here. 
Oh, no, no, I cannot push that one. I cannot push that one. Okay, I'm going to get stun locked here, apparently. Okay, man. So much violence happening to me. So much awful things. But what I want to do is push all the blocks so I have access to the spikes down there. You see? You, you, you fellas no, follow me, what I'm trying to do here. The mission I'm trying to accomplish. It would be great, those guys. No, no, my camera. Pretty friggin' important to keep it. Hey guys, do you want to maybe come this way? Because I really don't want to kill you one by one. Come on. Maybe I can do... Yeah, oh man, that's indestructible? That is... Not part of the plan, I just drop right in there. <laughs> so freaking bad. Oh, holy crap, this is much incredibly harder than I went in expecting. Because of the ghost. The only reason is the damn ghost. I don't have the time to kill everybody. But it does feel like I should kill all this. These undead people first. Let's do that. Whoa. Push, 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 push. That's a bad one to drop. Now I have no way of accessing the exit. So I cannot drop that one. Otherwise... The whole level is ruined. So, thanks! Thanks for that! <laughs> Way of getting myself killed. Let's just get myself destroyed once more. I'm just weirded out by how incredibly difficult this is. Do I have bombs or ro I have bombs and ropes. <sighs> Am I intended to have bombs and ropes? That's another thing I feel like I don't think I'm supposed to have that, you know? Because this uh, feels designed to to work on your wits alone, but holy crap, this is so difficult. I'm going to just use the bombs. I don't give half a crap. Get these guys triggered so they can merrily make their way to their own deaths. No, that's not what I meant to pick up. I think I just lost my uh, my camera. Thank God. Pushed all the way down. There it is. No! Ow! Without the camera, all those vampires will just eat you alive. Quite literally. They will suck your blood until you die. Uh, okay, that works. Let's slide into that place. There you go. Now have the camera. There. Alrighty, stage number two. Stealing his bane. I don't know what that's supposed to be. Oh boy, that's good. There you go. Oh, he didn't die. Alrighty. A vampire for Kali. It would be really nice to get an item out of this. Beautiful. No, 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 why you get that, you fool? Just drop a cape. I cannot drop a cape because I pick up the capes. So let's do that. There. Uh -huh. She assists my sacrifice because I'm a devout follower. Alright. Hate it, hate it, hate it. Paste. There you go. <laughs> I'll give a crap. We just sacrificed Vlad, that might be a uh, uh, world first. I don't think I've ever done that. Sacrificing Vlad to Kali, pretty cool. Oh shit, I don't want a uh, mouthful of spiders here. The Kapala, look at that. And a terrible chill runs down my spine. Come on, just need, I just need one more kill. I just need to kill that guy, I cannot move in, move on. Just the one dude. I do have ropes, since uh, completely karma has seen fit to leave me with the starting items, which I'm perfectly fine with, because holy shit, was that le this level, I feel is really, really massively difficult, 
without being using without be, being able to use a a few bombs to one clear the way. Oh, I'm an idiot. <laughs> the worst. I am an idiot. I should just use a bomb to kill this guy. There you go. And the Kapala. Maybe you can get me a little bit of extra health. Nah. So right. So right. Yeah, a little bit of that. Um, finally got through the level. I would have easily left many, many moons ago. Should have kept my camera. But, you know, it, it's, it's not the spirit. It's not the spirit. We must. The rules is we have to kill all the shopkeepers. And now apparently we have angry shopkeepers. And I am okay with that. The skill. Tell man, because, you know, he, he is alive, and he must die. I'm pretty sure he's invulnerable to all bullets, except, you know, tiny spikes. So, that is nice. Look at all those weapons down there. Alrighty, we have our choice of what to use. Who's going to teach them a lesson? We're just going to teach them a lesson. I, I have to run through all this stuff. I don't know why I went through all that. That it was uh, probably a bad idea. <laughs> uh, I had no need to pick up any of those things. Kind of weird out that uh... Dave slaves. <laughs> kind of weird out that uh, you are allowed to use all of this stuff. This is kind of silly because all of these guys are dead now. Whoop. Ha, fool! I wonder what kind of message we have. Welcome to the mall! <laughs> I don't think so, friends. You're all going to be exploding pretty damn soon. Oh, there's more people down there. Wait, 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 wait. This is so satisfying. Opening crates is so great. Love it. I will... I just have this feeling I'm going to get killed by... By, uh... One of these guys. They will just shoot me in the face. Alright. See what happens down here. Achievement game, you're a horrible person. You know it, man. You know me well. I am so glad that we speak eye to eye. That was beautiful. Very happy about killing all of Dave's slaves. And I, I, if I had not spent so long in the previous level, I would totally keep killing these people. Let's stick with the boom. Actually. Let's go super OP. I don't even give a crap. <laughs> Let's go super OP and grab the scepter. The, this is going to be a massacre, hopefully. It's going to be good times all around. Oh, Yamasaron! Oh, man. If I had known that we're not going through 20 levels of this, I would totally would have, uh, you know, taken more, much more of my sweet ass time uh, enjoying everything and making absolutely certain that I do all the goofy things that I like to do. I just thought that, oh man, this is going to take forever if I keep uh, at this level of incompetence, you know. At this level of incompetence, we're not going to get to hell until two hours from now. So, I just wish I had known. Let's just kill all these people. This is something that will... Line to see King Yama, they are a bunch of supplicants. They are just so eager to get bigger penises. That's all the desires they have. Please, Yama, give me a bigger penis. Oh boy, will this be fun to push this all the way to the other side and then suddenly everybody explodes. This is so much anticipation for it. It's like, like you know you have this box of chocolates you really like. Like I am a sucker for Ferrero Rochers, those balls of, of nuts. I love balls of nuts. I, I just love balls, balls of nuts. Uh, I the anticipation of opening the thing and just oh, put it in your face. And, and open the thing. That, that's exactly what's happening here. It has been such a great time. <laughs> oh, and that was such a great time for everybody involved. That was not them. So we got a bit of a gauntlet going on here. Okay, oh, then Yama's going to do that. I'm so glad that they not jump straight to my what? <laughs> well, that was cool. That was extremely violent and cool, and I am happy that happened. I was like, oh no, uh, slow motion escape. That worked out though. Not good. Stun locked or nothing. Okay, so I guess now we're looking for the exit. 
which I am assuming is all the way up here. I completely forgot I had the Chris knife too. So yeah, the way to do this uh, level is to maybe challenge yourself and not pick up. If I had known, again, if I had known it was uh, this was the end, I would have stuck more to the philosophy of being super underpowered and trying to make things work with however l few items that I had. But hey, it was fun. It was a nice change of pace. And uh, I encourage you to challenge yourself with less items that I used. Uh, which, I mean, it wasn't like awful. I used the kind of unconventional stuff, I feel. Except the shotgun at the beginning. But I stole that from a shopkeeper, so I just felt right in my bones to use that against my enemies. Anyway, this has been King's ya King Yama's Gauntlet by Completely Karma. All the description, all the links in the description below, as usual. And it was a great time, good stuff, fun times for everybody involved. Kind of short-ish, and I am appreciative of that as well, because, you know, when when a level pack is over long, it kind of overstays its welcome. Uh, but here's my advice to you, my good friend. Maybe put it in the description, hey, this is four levels. What was that, four levels? This is just a four-level gauntlet. Don't get fooled by starting to, into the mines and the final challenge is killing Yama, we're not going through all of Spelunky. This is a four level challenge. That's as a, a nice courtesy in the description that it sh I feel should always be included. Anyway, hope that you liked it. I had a good time and we'll see what happens in the next episode. Until then, I bid you farewell.